we got to go get the verses, a verse. Okay. My Ute name is Kasi. They call me Kasi. And that's, that's about all. Say your name. Goshiha. Goshiha. Close, home. Okay. Sahant A. Yujiha Ina. I sala Yujiha E. Itwe de Nije. Abenchi. Yujiha Kage Itwe de Ina. Gantwa Hele O Na. Wakota B. Fa Kahe O Fla. Yujiha Go Wedene E. De Kile. Na Go Wedene De Le. Ake Engo and. Yatichi si he gale, not where the nee si he wile. Sahande, yujiha e, kenonk enji, agansaga, no yut net ne. There were ten groups, ten communities of yuchis who were moved here. Now we're down to three. Yujiha wa ni ina, go ina, de ki o we de ni, o we de ni e de ki ni. Abenchik ase les enale got a yujiha e sans e wedeni. Poor as I know, the language is just about to disappear. We are trying to bring it back by right through the teaching of these younger ones. Yeah, our own origin story is that Yuchis came from the sun, and in our language we're called Zoyaha, which means children of the sun. But we do feel like God gave us our language, and it's up to us to carry it on. And some of the elders tell us that God only hears us when we pray in Yuchi, so it's a really strong connection spiritually. Even now when I pray, I'd rather pray in Yuchi. I'd rather sing my songs in Yuchi because it seems like it's just, the Lord is just so much closer. And I just feel, you know, I can, I can feel differently than when, it, when I sing English songs. The Yuchi language has been suppressed for generations. Uh, when my grandmother grew up not knowing how to speak English, uh, she went to the uh, Yuchi Mission boarding school here in Sapulpa, where the high school now is. And that was where kids were punished if they spoke their language. Okay. Yujiha eat wede o te ina, Yujiha go wede nek akanichi ke ok anfe jen, son kenok enji. Kasot nechi kede taho fla, be shen a abenchi, na no wole na. Yu galen saga, o hahani ina, kifa iga, Yujiha go wede ne e ononzo tani. Eventually, we began to understand that really the only way to uh, develop full competency in the language was to do it through immersion uh, methods, to stay all uh, in the language during the entire time that the uh, learning is going on. Rather than trying to use English to teach Yuchi, uh, we began to use the Yuchi language to teach Yuchi. Nobody else on the earth can speak the way you do and you know and that's that's how I felt about it when I first came on is that I need to learn this language real quick and try to get as much knowledge as I can because you never know, you know, which one's going to leave, you know, one of our elders is going to leave because someday, you know, they're going to be gone. I feel sad. Very sad. Now Sam is enough. I'm the only man speaker. 
if there's any more up there, I wish they'd come forth and help out. But we can't find any out there. If we don't learn it now, it's going to be lost. And that's a huge responsibility. Wa ishta athlape, bifetawi, gakawena, yujihaina, hile o yale, ji all and jen, son kene ha jen. Our joy and challenge is to bring back, revitalize our language, keep it alive in the community, carry it forward so that our, our children our, and our grandchildren can also say, Yujiha ne no, son ke ne no. We Yuchi people, we are still here. Hele Ijiha, we le he. Kalakara nisha na he donda. Abenchi, Yujiha he na, wano ta. Di ha ke ene, di ha ke don ene, yuji ha ho, wa ali ni ne ho no ta, wa hende, ta he e hong a fe. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, sure, thank you.